With the Mac certified to fly by the FAA, it's an only matter of time before Boeing can resume deliveries. It's narrow body around the world, but with the new EU tariffs inflating the cost of these aircraft by 15%, Boeing faces an uphill battle to get aircraft to its big European customers. Eddie Wilson, CEO of European low-cost carrier Ryanair, believes that Biden's arrival could be the change to the re and the relationship needs. Mid-October, just weeks before the U.S. presidential election, saw the WTO authorizing Europe to stick four four billion dollars worth of tariffs on imported U.S. goods. The imposed tariffs added 25% to a range of agricultural and industrial products and crucially on 15% of imported aircraft. For Boeing sitting on a stockpile of several hundred 737 MAX, many of which were dis destined for Europe, this was an unwelcome turn of events adding 15% to the cost of aircraft purchases was unlikely to go down well with its custom unlikely to go down well with its customers one of the biggest of which is European low-cost airline Ryanair speaking at Kappa live recently CEO Ryan of Ryanair DCA Eddie Wilson DAC Eddie Wilson said that he sees the change of the president in the US has something that could undo the damage done over the last four years to the US EU friendship he said he said I think now with the president elect Biden is reaching out to to Europe I think we're going to have a completely different relationship he mentioned Biden's causing up to European nations referencing the US president elects European phone phone calls on November 10th Biden had spent some time chatting with the European leaders including the French president the German chancellor and the Irish prime minister Wilson sees the sees this reaching out as a sign of things to come I think that's going to seep down through the through into a re reset on the relationship and I think we would expect to find that the throwing bottles at one another isn't the way to go about things. These are the two main aircraft manufacturers in the world. They are going to compete on a even footing as they had been for many years he said. With 135 Boeing 737 MAX on order, Wilson is keen to avoid seeing the prices jacked up by 15%. While Ryanair likely got a great deal on such a large aircraft order, an additional 15% on top of the agreed price could see the cost inflated by as much as $2 billion. Wilson was a mandant that the airline hoped to see a scrap of tariffs but was clear that Ryanair wouldn't be big.